Good evening. Welcome to my laboratory. Um, I want to demonstrate an interesting effect that I just discovered. This is the uh, TK Laser Saber Super Looper circuit with uh, a crazy round loop stick that I described in a previous video. and uh, one end of the middle 20 turn coil is still disconnected the inductors all the way in and I've changed the transistor to a 2SC3198 okay 2SC3198 and uh, the voltmeter is monitoring the voltage on the supply capacitor there, that one ferret capacitor and the load is three LEDs in series okay so right now we're showing 0.202 volts on that capacitor and nothing's happening. So I'm going to go ahead and take my power supply here oops, sorry, and we'll charge that capacitor to to about one and a half volts if I can get it done there. All right. So anyway, we're charged now to uh, to about 1.3 volts, and you can see that all three of those LEDs are really glowing brilliantly. Right. Okay. Now, as you know, I have a discharge button on this device where I can push the button and uh, short the capacitor through um, through a one ohm resistor to get the voltage down to the experimental range. That's too dark, sorry. I'm trying to get the right kind of illumination here to show this effect. Uh, you can see that the LEDs are still good and bright and I'm still discharging a little bit of the voltage a bump at a time. I want to get down to where the LEDs are just kind of dim there. Really, really dim. Okay. So they are still barely, barely on, and we're down around eight tenths of a volt. So that's, you know, kind of ordinary jewel thief behavior, right? So eight tenths of a volt or lower, the LEDs go out. Now here's what I wanted to demonstrate. The free end of this middle coil is free, but I'm going to now touch it to the positive supply uh, terminal, which is also where the base resistor is connected, right? Okay, now watch the voltage and the LED brightness. The LEDs get, get really bright again, and the system keeps working. Can you see how bright those LEDs are? Now they're beginning to fade, and now they're out. So down to about just over just over one tenth of a volt, those LEDs stay on brilliantly when that when that middle lead of the coil is connected there. So I'm gonna turn my power supply down to three tenths of a volt okay and now I'm going to apply the power again three tenths of a volt to charge that capacitor I think Okay, now it does go down pretty fast at, at, uh, when it's hooked up that way, but look at that. There's a Jewel Thief lighting up three LEDs in series on under two-tenths of a volt input. Let's do that again.
See how bright those LEDs are? Of course, the current drain is not low, but the voltage amplification is really good. Thanks for watching.